Hello guys, now I'll be showing you how easy to calibrate this black line G7C unit. Okay, all we need to do is to have the cylinder gas which is having H2S 25 ppm, CO 100 ppm, methane 2.5 percent, 50 percent LEL, oxygen 18 percent, and nitrogen balance. So this gas should be matching our G7C unit okay so if you want to check what we can do is to press ok at least twice and then we can go to gas option we can go to view gas info and we can go to calibration gas okay so this is equal to the gas that we have okay it will also show when you are in the calibration mode so let's now start doing the calibration okay we have now attached our regulator and our calibration cap so let's start press calibration okay okay so that is the gas that we have continue yes okay zeroing just press ok and we should be in a clean air or fresh air we have those checks then start span all we need to do is to attach the calibration cap and then open our cylinder and then we need to wait until it will be completed. Okay, there we go. Turn off gas and press OK. And then we'll remove. You have seen those check and showing 180 days. And let us have our gas go down. It should have H2S, 0 ppm, CO, 0 ppm, LEL, 0%, oxygen, 20.9%. Okay, so this is now the normal display we can do also bump testing so how can we do bump testing we can just press the ok again and then we go to gas option we can do bump test then press ok then continue okay then start bump so we need to attach our calibration cup first and then press bump and then apply your gas. Turn off gas. Press OK. So bump test result 30 days. And then we will wait again until the concentration will be in normal display. H2S, 0 ppm. CO, 0 ppm. LEL, 0 percent. Oxygen, 20.9 percent. We can do also a function test. Just like applying a gas, simulating on the air that we have. Let's just open our cylinder and then apply the gas. Let's see if the sensor will function as it is expected. Okay. So that's it.
we can also check the highest concentration that this unit have detected we can go to the peak reading so let's wait for this okay let's try it press ok and then again we can go gas option we can go view gas info we can go to the peak reading and we can also reset the peak so let's see the peak reading so these are the concentration that has been applied to our unit okay then we can also reset the peak okay so it will be on the baseline of our sensor training okay reset peaks yes so it is now on the baseline of those gases then we can now go back and then on our normal view and we can also shut down the unit okay so let's shut down Okay, so that's it guys. I hope you have learned something. Bye now.